It's now been 10 long years since popular blues musician John Spira vanished without a trace. Is it still a missing person case, or is it classified as a homicide? It's considered a missing person case, certainly the suspicious circumstances. But do you still think that John Spirit is alive? No. John's family believes he was murdered. And while Dave Steuben has never been charged in connection with the case, they think his business partner may have had something to do with it. Dave Steuben independently, or Dave Steuben with somebody else, did it. Dave Steuben was cooperating with investigators, then got a lawyer and cut off all communication. Did Steuben then impede the investigation by not cooperating? Eventually he did impede the count, yes. He co-owns a property, and we certainly thought it'd be appropriate to search that property. It's about 110 acres in Missouri, and um, he refused to consent to search to that property. If he has nothing to hide... Right. Unfortunately for us, the fact that we can't talk to him, even with an attorney present, kind of puts us in a, in, in between a rock and a hard place. So we thought, if Dave Steuben won't talk to detectives, maybe he'll talk to us. We're doing an investigation to the disappearance of John Spear. Why are you covering your face already? The sheriff's office says you're not cooperating with the investigation. Why is that? Mr. Steuben, why don't you want to talk and help find John Spear? I mean, look at this. He covers his face right immediately. The sheriff's office says he's not cooperating with the investigation, and he's going to drive off. This was his business partner for 20 years, and he's not helpful at all. The thing we have in common with the cops is Dave Steuben won't talk to us, and he won't talk to the police. Why is that? I'll let you be the judge. How would you classify Dave Steuben in the investigation? Now I would basically describe him as a brick wall. He's in our way. If he helped, he would be alongside of us, but by not helping, he's in the way. What does that say to you? Well, it could say a few things. He doesn't want to be involved because he doesn't know anything, or he does know something, so he doesn't want to be involved, or he is the reason John Spera is missing. Assuming that Dave Steuben decided to sit down with you, with his lawyer present, of course, what questions would you ask him? What are you hiding? What do you think? What do you know? We have to clear up the discrepancy on who saw John last. I think second of all, it would be, Dave, let's let us search your property. If you have nothing to hide, there's no reason why we can't go search your property. Dave Steuben has never been charged with anything related to the disappearance of John Spira. And while the DuPage County Sheriff's Office does consider him a person of interest, he's not alone. There's a list of people that are close to John that I would call people of interest. Okay. Anyone close to someone who disappears or is murdered are gonna be people of interest. Um, so he's one of many. I miss him. I miss him a lot. I wish I could give him a hug and say, welcome back, and let's get the band back together. For family and friends, life without John truly is like the blues. What do you miss most about your brother? I miss his music, his laugh. I miss the three of us, me, Tommy, and John. I haven't laughed as hard since, you know, in the last 10 years. How hard has John's disappearance been on your parents? You know, I wish there was a word that could describe it. I mean, this is the ultimate nightmare. There's a good chance that Dave Steuben's watching this right now. What's your message to him? If you have nothing to hide, then stop hiding, David. We're not going away. John's family vows to never stop searching for answers, and today, they need your help. Here's another look at pictures of John Spira last seen in 2007 in West Chicago. He was 45 years old, 5'8", 160 pounds, with brown hair and brown eyes. If you know anything about his disappearance, you can submit a tip at CrimeWatchDaily.com or call the DuPage County Sheriff's Department at 630-407-2326.